Hey girlfriends, I have been holding on to these straggly ends since my big chop. If you would like to see how I take these straggly tired ends to this wonderful trim from my friend Simone and Natural Trendsetter, stay tuned. Hey how are you? Welcome back to my channel. Today is Friday, February 16th, 2013. I'm here to promote healthy hair. Okay, healthy hair means I don't want to purposely do something that is going to give me a setback where instead of going forward, I'm going backwards. So I've decided to trim my hair at least one time a year and I'm going to leave that to the professionals. Okay, I'm going to leave it to the professionals. I think there, there are just some things that you leave to the professional. I tried doing it myself. It didn't work. Um, because as you can see from my hair, if you look at this section, this is what I have going on here, like right here. And I know you're probably saying, oh, just go ahead and snip it off. I tried that before and those tired looking ends are still there. Hey, curl friends. So to the left of your screen, this is the before picture. And then to your, the right of your screen, this is after my visit with Simone. Now, the only reason why I chose Simone to do my hair is because I trust her. Now, I have heard a lot of stories as far as bad experience, good experience with us going to the stylist and when we say trim and they actually cut. I've never had any issues with Simone. I've been going to her for quite a few years. So when I explained to her that I haven't trimmed my hair in over a year she understood what i meant i didn't have to keep going back and forth so that is a good thing this is just the outside of her salon she's actually located in tamar florida and i will leave all the information in the description box where if you are ever here in florida or if you live here in florida and you want to go see her you just reach out to her via her um, office number or her website this is what my hair is looking like um, after the shampoo and I'm going to do a, another video letting you guys know what happened to my hair after I put that Shea Moisture color in there. Y'all got to stay tuned for that. Okay, well, natural hair needs to be trimmed. A lot of people love to have long natural hair, but if you don't trim it, it can't grow good. Now, my hair is beautiful and healthy, but if you can hear it, when I get to the ends, it's a little crunchy. So that's how you know you need a trim. So if your hair sounds crunchy all the way through, come to trim it. <laughs> and right here, that's all that really needs to go. Is that okay with you, mama? Mm -hmm. You gonna live? Yes. Okay, great. <laughs> okay, tell us what, um, why didn't you trim, yes, <laughs> tell us. It's why didn't you trim my hair when it was wet? Because when your hair is wet, it's in the shrunken state. And because your hair is kinky all the way through, it was curly all the way in. I can't stretch it out and see where it's compromised when it's curly. And every time I stretch it out and cut it, it shrinks back up. Some textures I do cut wet, but it's not this tight here. If it's a looser wave or a curl, you know, or if it's relaxed and natural, I can see the straight hair on the ends. So in some incidences, I cut wet and in some I cut dry yours I need to cut dry because it's such a little bit you know what I mean I need to see where it needs to go like you see up here it's a little more than it is over here you see that yeah not a lot but you see it? yeah yeah Can you see where it's uneven that's why I know it has to go right up in there you see how you can see through that part but you can't see through this part you see that does that make sense This is impossible to do yourself, people. <laughs> You're gonna get blocked for that. Maybe it could be that your hair, this section of your head, the texture is just 
Yeah, this this was the side, like when I was transitioning, mm -hmm. oh my God, it was coily, kinky, like yeah. it was really different compared to the rest of my hair. Right. See, I knew that. Just yeah, that was my one. Okay, so before Simone started actually trimming my hair, I asked her to do an assessment of my hair and what um, she realized, especially in the back of my head, is the back of my head was more, I wouldn't say damaged, but it was more dry. It's of a different texture. So what she was explaining to me is that most of the time when we apply our leave-in conditioner, our oil, and all that other moisturizing stuff, we tend to forget about the back of our head. So the front part, the sides, the middle are always moisturized, always soft, and the back is like crispy back there. When she was combing that section out, you could actually hear my hair popping, like kernels, like popcorn popping. So that's one thing that she stressed that I actually have to pay more attention when I'm moisturizing my hair. I have to pay attention more back there. On the um, left side of my hair, I think she had to cut off, I think around an inch from the previous pictures before, because that side, um, was a little bit more, um, stressed out than the rest of my hair. Child boo, you couldn't tell me nothing about my hair trim. I love, love, love my trim. Um, I have been going to Simone for quite a few years now, and she is one of the stylists, actually the only stylist. Um, stylists that I have allowed to clip, cut, do anything as um, out of um, like my crochet braids, anything like that. She's the only one that actually I allowed to even think about putting the scissors in my hair. Simone um, have 20 plus years of experience with natural hair, relaxed hair. Um, you know, I trust her, and I'm very, very happy with my trim. Um, I don't have any problem. I don't have any problem. I actually love my hair. My hair is much thicker. It's much fuller. Um, I have big, happy, healthy hair. Um, so I'm going. I'm going to leave her information in the description box below. And if you guys are local, um, if you're in Dade, Broward, Palm Beach County, if you're coming from out of town and you want to have a consultation with Simone. All her information will be down below where you can reach her. Um, yeah, so this is it. Like I said, I love, 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 love my Okay, I'm not conceited, y'all. I'm just feeling myself. Hey, I am loving, loving, loving my trim. I am feeling myself. So, yeah, let me tell you, I played in my hair, no lie, for about two, three hours. When I came home, had a little mini photo shoot going on. So, yeah, I really, really love my hair. Like, I know I could not have done this at home by myself. I don't care how much I twist my hair and clip the ends. There is no way that I could have done this bundle of hair to the perfection that it is this way. I want to say thank you so much, Simone. And I will see you shortly. I thank you, my curl friends, and I'll see you on the next video.